So the next one. Nail Arts. Blue, purple, gold, white and black. Technique surprised me. I think I go with the same technique here to give all the colors well at least a chance. <laughs> But I didn't mix any purple yet, so I need to mix this first. This is what I would call unexpected result. <laughs> Not sure about this one yet. We will see if it works when I add some silicone or if we need to redo this. Not so much a fan of it. I will make another pour just over it and see what happens there. We will see. At least all colors are in. <laughs> I will torch it and see what it brings. There is some silicone underneath so perhaps this pops a bit through. Not so much. <laughs> So let's 
let's go to the next one and this is Danielle. Any shade of blue and a swipe. Next one, Joseph Fiori. You choose color and poor style. Okay, <laughs> this doesn't make it easier for me. <laughs> but let's see, perhaps you can be fancy for this one. Let's see when we do. A bit of the red. And perhaps a bit of the turquoise in the outer ring. I love the gold. And perhaps, well, I think it must be right. And perhaps some of the dark. I have no idea if this works. <laughs> Especially in such a size. We will see. This was fun. <laughs> really, it was. So let's see if I can get some of the paint from the last floor to help the paint flow a bit better. This is pretty much always kind of pretty, isn't it? <laughs> but well, we will see. canvas has the wrong shape for just a ring pour, like a ring, so um, yeah, it looks better on a longish canvas, but let's see what we can make out of it here. This one is cool, isn't it? I really love this one. Next one is Kathy Dale. 
and we are going to do a turquoise, gold and purple, no silicone, a drag, flip and drag. So this sounds like a negative space thingy, which I pretty much do not very often. <laughs> so challenge accepted, Kathy. But let's see where we, how we can do this, perhaps. Let's double this first. If I had the third hand, I would have thirded it, <laughs> tripled it. But as I don't, I'm using this one to see if I can make a, a, a third, you know? I have so much no idea if this works. You know what? I really kind of like this. It has some cells, although there is no silicone in. It has some movement. And it has all the colors you wanted. Is it okay for you as the negative space pour? So, and the last one for today is... Chris Boos. And the colors are royal blue, gold and white, ring dirty acrylic pour. Okay, so colors, nothing new today. <laughs> and I think I will use a little cup tool again. I really liked the last look of it. So let's see.
And here are the results of this pouring series. I hope you liked the results as much as I liked making them. And of course, I look forward to hear your comments in the comment section. <laughs> so I'm going to make the next 10 and final pours in the next week and again split the video into two videos of five pours and yeah, going to show them when they are ready. So if you have any questions as usual please leave me down below in the comment section. If you want to see what I've used when it comes to the materials you can see this in my video description and you can also find my Etsy shop and my social media link there if you want to have a look or get in touch with me. If this was the first video that you have seen of mine and you liked it, please make sure to give me a thumbs up and even better subscribe to my channel to not miss out any of my new videos. Therefore, please also click the bell icon to get the notifications. So thank you for your time, thank you for watching and other than that, I hope to see you in my next video. Have a great day! Bye bye!